Damn it. Traffic is insane at this hour. That's what I get for trying to take a shortcut to the gym. Come on! Huh? Stop standing around! Or do their lives not matter to you? Someone step up! You're all on the clock! Huh? And they're waiting! Please! We're trying to work with you! No! No police! Hey, excuse me. Sorry, but why haven't the professionals stopped these guys yet? Uh, you haven't heard? The villains are threatening to kill the people inside if anyone crosses the barrier. Nobody knows what to do. They sound like they want civilians to fight them, but that's crazy. Jeez. Has there been any sign of All Might? Huh? Or maybe some other heroes? I don't know. It seems like a hero would only make things worse. Interesting. Hey, it's okay. Calm down. A UA student. Hey! UA! Huh? Don't disappoint me! Huh? Uh. Get down! <gasps> hey, are you okay? Uh, my leg... I can't... Hold still! I'm right here. Don't worry. Shit. It hurts. It's alright. I've got you. Wait. That uniform, you, you were in the sports festival. Mind control guy, y you're a hero, aren't you? <sighs> I'm working on it. Ah, are you serious? This is the worst. Do you want these people to die? No one's even going to speak up in their defense. Hey, huh? I will. You, you a. It's about time! You think you're up to snuff, kid? Not really. I'm not much of a fighter. I just have a question. No more silent treatment, Erwin! Words! I want words! Either we have words, or we see if you can land like a cat too! I'm tired of asking questions with no answers, and your continual diversion will no longer be tolerated! Speak now! Huh? 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 <laughs> you! So, how was your first day at school? Erwin, fix what you did. I didn't do anything. Don't! No more jokes. I'm not in the mood. Now put things back the way they were. I... look, I'm gonna level with you, so just hear me out. There isn't actually anything wrong with this universe. It's just a little different from yours, that's all. Oh, sweet! You found Schrodinger! So you do know this cat! I've been chasing this little guy all day! I thought he was you! Yeah, I asked him to keep an eye on you so you didn't get lost. Lost? Yeah, it's a big world. I wanted to make sure you saw enough of it to answer my question. You're still going on about that stupid question? Yeah, I was hoping to get a second take on that conversation we had, now that you've gotten a taste for what... And I can see you're upset. That's totally normal, and I understand your frustration. But before you hit me, you may want to consider the fact that I'm the one who knows where your precious students are. Also, I'm your only way home, so... Mm. I'm just saying. Where is young Midoriya? Just him? You're not curious about the others? Your students? Your injury? Or have you already figured out the rest? And you just need Midoriya to put it together. Hmm. Two inches. That was what you said. Two inches. Was the difference between me and my injury. Because of two inches, I defeated all for one six years ago without crippling myself. Meaning I never needed a successor. So I never trained Midoriya. He may not have even applied to UA since Uraraka wasn't in class. It's possible that she either failed the entrance exam, or that she only scored high enough to make it to class B. Since much of her score was due to saving Midoriya at the 11th hour. And without young Midoriya to intervene young Ida... You've made your point, Erwin. 
Now put things back the way they were. While I'm flattered at your newfound humility, that's not why I brought you here. What? Yeah, you weren't taking me seriously, so I figured the whole two inches thing was just a good jumping off point. I don't actually care about this dimension. It just so happens to be a good example of my question this morning. So how about it? Wanna try again? I'm dying to hear how your answer has changed. No, stop! This is ridiculous! I'm not playing! Oh, come on! Think about it! Push those last two brain cells for me and think! Why this world? What did I initially ask you about when you walked in this morning? Don't make a face. If you answer correctly, then you're that much closer to getting home. Scout's honor, remember? <laughs> Scout's honor. Let's see. You proposed the idea of multiple dimensions. I believe you've proven your point on that. After that, you asked if I would still save someone even if I knew they'd die in a parallel dimension. I said yes, and you didn't like that. Which started a fight which led to the two inches comment. Then you sent me here to learn a lesson. You showed disdain for my answer, which is why, I assume, you chose a world in which my student is a villain, which would force me into an impossible position. And since I know you're a nihilist who resents someone like me for idealism, then that must mean... You want me to try and save Midoriya from his life of crime and villainy. Just so you can prove... that I can't. Well, look at that, ladies and gentlemen. He can think. And all on his own. I'm so proud. So I guess this is the dimension where you lose your temper and I fall to my death? No. Uh. Huh? This is the dimension where you lose a bet and get proven wrong at your own game. I'm taking you with me so we can save Midoriya together. Uh. No, it's fine. You could drop me. I'm still alive in, like, millions of other dimensions, so it's cool. No, no, no! You wanted me to play the game! So now's the time to don your cleats and join the field, kid! No! Stop! This isn't a buddy road trip thing! I don't want to be friends! I was just trying to be petty and get you to admit that you're wrong! I actually hate you! Put me down! Put me down or I'll trap you in this dimension forever! I mean it! Oh, I'm sure you do. But then I suppose that means I win, then. Wait, d no it doesn't! Yes, it does. If you leave, then you're the Irwin who was too afraid to see it through. The Irwin whose ideals were too weak to withstand his own test. Which is fine. I mean, you can leave whenever you want. But just remember, of every Irwin in existence, you'll be the one that's a coward. <laughs> Son of a... I know where he is. Looks like time's up. Five more minutes. You said that five minutes ago. Then ten more minutes. Midoriya, I know I'm still new, but is putting it off like this normal for you guys? It is. Hey, why do we have to copy ourselves like this? We were just fine before. Look, twice being added to the team means we can go into more public areas with minimal risk. It means more cameras for our message. And also a higher chance of you coming back. Ugh, it takes out all the fun. We're not here for fun, Akane! You're not. You know, I let you in because you said you wanted to change things. Cry me a river, Quirkless. <laughs> Your bleeding heart's only endearing to a point. Guys, shut up! Guys, someone's here! Smash! <laughs> Have no fear! For I am here! All might! <laughs> no more, young Midoriya. It's time to go home. Midoriya!